Hello physics, linear momentum. This is a new chapter, so we will uh, solve this problem. A tennis ball may acquire a speed of 55 meter per second, which is equivalent to 120 mile per hour. If the mass of the ball is a 0 0.060 kg and uh, and is in contact with the racket for uh, time, which is a 4 millisecond, what is the average force on the ball? So we have to find the force on the ball. So the force is equal to momentum, so uh, delta P over delta T. So the P is uh, mv, momentum. So delta P, so delta P is equal to uh, P F minus, in the final minus initial. So, which is equal to MVF minus MVI, or which is equal to MVF, VI. So, if you substitute this value here, so this will be equal to MVF minus VI, which is over delta T. So, VI is uh, zero. So, m v f over delta t so mass is uh, uh, 6.0 into 10 raised power 3 kg into v is 55 meter per second divided by time which is equal to 4 millisecond, 4 into 10 power minus 3. And if you multiply these two, so this this cancel, so which is equal to about 800 newtons. So this is the force. This is the force exerted on the ball from the player. And this force, if uh, man mass is uh, about 80 kg, so... So the force uh, mg weight uh, weight is equal to mg, which is equal to eighty times nine point eight one. If it is ten, so this uh, force this force is enough to uh, pull. A, so it is uh, less than eight hundred newtons. So this is a very big force. So the tennis ball may acquire a speed of 55 meter per second, and then the force is 800 newtons, which is enough to uh, pull a human of 80 kg.